ten fifteen two thousand and twelve pre market gap. The time is six oh nine AM Pacific Standard Time in twenty one minutes. The opening bell shall be here. One of the things that we're noticing from Friday was about that antitrust case that surfaced on Google. Google will report earnings after the closing bell on Thursday. We have a lot of upgrades today, but let's take a look. One of the upgrades is on this ISRG gap, which I will show here our MMTs is, is that we close at 594. Now they report earnings this week. And it's very common that they like to upgrade lots of things ahead of time. Like we just had an upgrade on IBM, $243 price target from 221 ahead of the earnings report. And it's quite common that a lot of these analysts will pump these things ahead of the earnings. So here's a gap open up. ISRG, you got Apple up here. So when I take a look at the NASDAQ futures being at 14.8 handles, it's one of the first times in the last four months that I haven't seen Google participating and leading this gap higher. And it's earnings related coming Thursday and about the simple fact that this one has a major headline event about antitrust case. So it's going to create a lot of price volatility between now and Thursday. Let's be clear on it. Apple, on the other hand, had rumors about the court case in, in, in Japan with, with Samsung. They are appealing it. That is the headlines today. We're going to be watching it in our system. It says it has a buy on it. However, there's cautious comments on the iPhone out by Mr. Blair, analyst who is cutting the estimates on the iPhone, which will create some price volatility at 95,000 shares and you've got 20,000 shares and Google going nowhere. One of the things we're going to be watching as far as the NASDAQ composite goes is big bellwethers. Once again, the CMG that closed at 290, it was down here at 286.30. We'll be watching this one. It reports quarterly earnings. Everything is about quarterly earnings. But here is the NASDAQ composite gap open up. You got GOLD, you got Amazon getting a little bid. Okay, you've got, once again, this ISRG is going to be the focus. Gap open up on NASDAQ composite. 